There is no religion on earth that guarantees salvation. Only Christianity. There is no, salva no, no religion on earth that guarantees a man salvation. Only Christianity. In fact, some religions, their founders have asked their followers to pray for them. Because they are not sure of where they are going. It's only in Christianity, Jesus boldly, without anybody challenging him, said, I am the way. I don't have the way. I am the truth. I am the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. It's only in Christianity that we have assurance of salvation. I give unto you eternal life. And you shall never perish. Neither shall any man pluck you out of my hands. It's only in Christianity we have words that sounds like, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever believes in him shall not perish, but have everlasting life. In first John he says, he that has the son has life and has passed from death to life. No other religion. No other religion. It's only in Christianity that the founder died and told them, I will rise on the third day. And on the third day, he split that grave open came out of the grave triumphantly all other religions their founders are in the grave waiting for Jesus to judge them <laughs> glory to God and I have news for you the proof that he rose is not an empty grave the proof that he rose is not an empty tomb the proof that he rose is every one of you here that is born of the spirit we are the circumcision that worship God in the spirit and have no confidence in the flesh but rejoice in Christ our savior your knowledge of salvation is your knowledge of the Lord Jesus your knowledge of salvation is your knowledge of the Lord Jesus remember I told you the Bible is a theology the theology of the Bible is Christology. Understanding Christology is soteriology. Soteriology is a subject of the purpose for Christology. The purpose for the Christ is to save his people from their sins. To save his people from their sins. So to understand Christ, you must understand salvation. And to understand theology you must understand Christ but Christ can only be known within the framework of salvation am I teaching good